guess what time it is me and the hubby are going Halloween decor hunting today and we're taking you along with us so stay tuned let's see what kind of spooky goodies we can find today all right guys we're here at the at-home store again this will be my second trip coming to this at-home store the first time I came they had one aisle of fall and Halloween decorations out so hopefully they'll have a lot more Right when we walked in, they have these little skull trees with bats on the top. Those were cute. And they had these giant skulls that light up. These were super cool. These would be really cool if you have a large porch to decorate. I like the cute little furry spider with the green eyes. And look. Oh, they have some creepy cloth. I was going to say, look at Steve. The headless dude, he's just hanging out here. <laughs> here was some Nightmare Before Christmas. And these were some cool light up potion bottles. Here's a little light up zero. How cute is he? These were some candles and jack-o'-lanterns of Jack Skellington. He was $7.99. And these were some doormats for your front porch. I love the Ouija board doormat. Here's some dancing skeletons. I love the cute little ghosts. More skeletons. And these were a bunch of different jack-o'-lanterns with different facial expressions and different colors. I really like the black ones. And here were some hanging ghosts for $11.99. and some hanging skeletons. I like these pumpkins with the bats and I love these big candles. How cool are those? And here's some of the little light up Halloween trees. Some of these signs I showed you guys last time I went to at home. And some of these candles were new, like the tombstones and the rib cages. They didn't have those last time. I like that doormat. Here are some hand ground stakes and the gargoyles and the skeletons again. And this is just an overview of this aisle of all the spooky goodies. I really like those rib cage candles. Those are cool. And here they had some cute little gnomes. They didn't have those last time I was there. And this is new. A black skull with a purple snake that lights up. And look, I found my little candy corn ghost that I wanted. My hubby bought me that. How cute is he?
These were some really cool Halloween bottles. I liked this candle and it smelled really good. And look at the little hand with a spider on it and blue fingernails. Here's the eyeball mushroom. I love the little toads. Those are so cute. I got that little ghost last year. And I love this black cat. They didn't have it last time. It's $19.99. Here's some stackable ghosts. Some metal jack-o'-lanterns with witches' hats. Some little light-up black cats. I love the little angry, grumpy pumpkin. This is how I look when I have to go to work. <laughs> Here's some tombstones. And look at this, the veiled statue. She is really cool and haunting looking. And here's lots of pumpkins to choose from. Here's some spooky fencing for your yard. Little skeletons. And I loved this wreath. They didn't have this last time. It's like brown twigs with three black crows on it. I thought that was really cool. And here's some ornaments for your Halloween trees. You know, I put one up every year, or now I'll be putting two up. My big black Halloween tree and my smaller skinny Halloween tree. And here I'm showing you what the black skull with the purple skeleton looks like lit up. That's pretty cool. And look at the big gargoyles lined up here. Guys, I just wanted to share what I did get at the at-home store today. My husband bought me this adorable candy corn ghost. It was $9.99, and I saw this on someone else's YouTube video, and I said, oh my goodness, that's so cute. I hope our store has it, and they did. So, my sweet hubby bought it for me. How cute is that? And I'm gonna show you what it looks like with the lights out. It's so cool. <laughs> me this sign that says I'm a fall kind of girl because you guys know I love fall it's my favorite season and this was $4.99 guys I will have a lot more fall and Halloween videos coming up so stay tuned for those thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next one bye ghouls <laughs>